Hello guys, you are welcome to my inspirational TV channel. Let's pray as we start. Father Jehovah, King of Glory, we just love you. We worship you, we exalt your holy name. We thank you for this channel. We thank you for the life of my viewers. I thank you for the life of my family. I thank you for their family also. We thank you for what you are going to be doing here today, oh Lord, for all is in your hands. We thank you for the breath of life. Thank you, everlasting Father, for answering our prayer to Christ our Lord. Amen. You are welcome. Hello guys, good morning, good evening, good afternoon. How are you all doing today? I know you are fine to the glory of God. Yes, you are welcome to my inspirational TV channel. Yes, today I'm going to be talking to us to try to be contented with what we have. Let's learn how to be contented with what we have. When you are not contented with what you have, you can easily be angry with people when they are progressing. Be contented with what you have. Love that business that you have now. Love that husband that you have now. Those your children, love them. That job that you have now, love that job. Let me tell you one thing. Don't compare yourself with people. If you are not contented with what you have, you will easily try to be comparing yourself with people. Don't compare yourself with people. Let me tell you one thing. People can go a, a, a lot a, to a different lengths in order to impress people. You should not be one of those people. You should be happy with yourself. If you bought a shirt, even though it's not costly, wear it to the glory of God. If you wear a shoe, even though the shoe is not costly, wear it to the glory of God. After all, the Bible says we should be modest. Why do you want to compare yourself with somebody you just see post a picture on Facebook, you are crying that your husband is not doing this for you, that you are not doing this for yourself? It's not everything you see that you will compare yourself with. Be yourself. Be happy with that thing you have right now. Don't compare your husband with another person. You don't know what that person is going through. Some people can pretend to be smiling, but they are not smiling. Some people can pretend to use money, to, to borrow money to do a lot of things just to impress people, but they are not what they, they think they are. So love yourself. If you cook soup, even though it's too meat, eat it with joy. People can borrow money just to cook and put a lot of meat in that soup just to impress people but really they don't have it you be you be real with yourself love your husband love yourself you have one a, 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 a necklace don't cry that oh i don't have a lot of necklace you have one earring don't cry i don't have a lot of earring you have one shoe don't cry i don't have a lot of shoe you are looking at some people to use them to compare to yourself. Do you know if they borrow to do that? Do you know if they bought it credit? Let me tell you one thing. People can go a lot to any length just to impress people. You should not be one of them. Always be happy. Celebrate your husband. Celebrate your children. Celebrate yourself. Celebrate yourself. Always be happy. As I say it in the in the in the in the other video, when you are fat, be you. When you are slim, be you. When you are thin, be you. When you are short, be you. Don't make yourself be depressed. You are the one that is making yourself depressed. When you are fat, buy your size. I know that I'm not a thin person. I bought the shirt that is my size, so I will be happy with what I wear. It's only when you know you, 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 you are fat, but you, are, you want to wear size 38. It's not possible. You will always not be happy. Be contented with everything you have. Don't compare yourself. Don't even dare. Don't even dare to compare yourself. No. Ah, I'm going to that party. I have to look for somebody that will give me this money so that I will impress people. People buy car credit just to impress people that is closer to them. Is that what you are comparing yourself with? 
if you are riding just the car you are riding now even though it's just golf drive it with joy drive it with peace people can have Lamborghini they can borrow to buy it just to impress you you don't be materially minded be spiritually minded if you wear bed than sell it and so what wear it to the glory of God or whatever they call it wear it to the glory of God you can wear everything to God's glory you can wear everything to God's glory people can go and buy a lot of things just they maybe they want to do a party they can even borrow to do that party just to show to people that they are not suffering but they know within them is not real so you should not compare yourself with a lot of people go to different lengths in order just to impress people you should not do that be happy always be happy when you cook rice there is no meat tomorrow don't worry there will be meat the house you are staying now be comfortable be happy don't put pressure on your husband don't put pressure on yourself when you put pressure on yourself you will start having pressure yourself you will start thinking God, you are not blessing me. But God will say, I bless you. It's because the way you are seeing it, you want to, you want to, you want to be over rich. Let me tell you one thing. The way you are now, you are rich. If you can take it to be so. The way you are now, you are beautiful. If you can take it to be so. Don't let people impress you. Don't let people make you to, to be prejudged. You are a beautiful person. You are a lovely person. You can be hearing noise because I'm not at home right now. You are a beautiful person. Anywhere you go, always be yourself. Be yourself. Don't compare. Don't try to compare yourself with people. Don't try it. You know, today, some people will be disturbing ah this one have this shirt this one have this shirt i don't have it even though it's okay the car wear it with love wear it with boldness a time we come now you see we are the one that is more than okay we can. it's a step it's a level people can go any length they will borrow you will be looking at them they will borrow you will be looking at them you, you want to compare yourself with them. They will borrow and do a lot of things just to show to people that they are not suffering. But inside of them, they know that they are dying. They know that they are dying. They know that it's not what they are showing is not real. And you that is doing those things, you have to change for God to help you. Because the moment you are doing those things, God will say, okay, since you say you have everything, you have it, but you know you don't have it. People don't want to come closer to you. Nobody wants to help you because you, you tell them that you have a lot of things. Stop that. Let's be contented with what you have. When you are contented with what you have, you will easily, quick to be happy. But when you are not contented, all the time you will be depressed. Even though people are happy, you are not happy. You see somebody wear shirt. You don't even know if he borrow. You don't even know if he, if somebody that dash that person. You are just looking at that person and die. Even let me ask you, how will you look at somebody and be and be using that person to compare yourself? You should not do that. You should not do that. You have one child now. Celebrate God for that child. You have work now. Celebrate God for that work always be happy i don't want this video to be too long i'm not at home as i said i'm just sitting down here taking my coffee but i said let me talk to my family out there to be contented with what they have because a lot of people can go to any length to impress people but within them they know it's not real. you will see different pictures in facebook you will go to the house and be crying. Oh God, God, when will I have this? When will I? You are even better than them. 
You, you are even better than them. Why will you compare yourself? Don't compare yourself. Oh, I'm sick. This person is healthy. You are healed. Be happy with yourself. Be happy. Do you know when you're not always happy? When you are 30 years, you will look like 40 years. You will start having wrinkle. Always be happy with yourself. Be joyful. You are a love you person. You are a kind person. I told you before, there is no you too. You are a wonderful person. Be encouraged. Don't be depressed. Depression can make you to die very quick. You can make yourself not to be depressed. It's you that can make it to be so. No, I will never be depressed anymore. I have it all. Yes, you eat, even though it's spaghetti you have in the house, even though it's eba, eat it with joy. Eat it with peace. Eat it with love. And be happy with yourself. That sickness that you are going through right now, you are healing in Jesus' name. Don't compare yourself with any other person. I love you, but remember, Jesus loves you even more better. Okay? What you are going through now is not the end. You are going somewhere. If you see where you are going to, you'll be happy to read there. Because God will not walk in a place that you are depressed. He said, how can you find me? You will find joy. You will find peace. That is where you find God. Any place you are depressed, there is no God there. Any place you are not happy, there is no God there. So you will find Him when you have joy, when you have peace in you. No, don't compare yourself that, wow, this person is beautiful. Look at her face, no spots. Sun is light. Sun is pancake. Why sun is natural? Your face is beautiful. If you can see you, if you can see the real you, you will know that you are too beautiful to be depressed. I love you, but Jesus loves you even more better. Take care of yourself. The Bible says, those that know the Lord, they shall be strong, and they shall do exploits. Exploits you will do. Don't compare. Don't dare to compare yourself with people. Be contented with what you have. The money you are receiving right now, use it to your own way that you can. Don't, maybe you have, you know you are receiving 500 salary, 5,000 salary. Don't go and be putting budget of 10,000 salary when you know that it's 5,000 salary you are, you are receiving. When you are putting budget of 10,000 uh, things into 5,000 salary, from there you start the press. Oh, when 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 will this suffer end? When will this suffer end? But it's you that is making it to be so. With that five thousand, you can calculate it and still be happy. And still be happy. People will say okirika, and so they are the one that call it okirika. The moment you reach your body, it's no longer okirika. It's your own maid. Give him your own name. Give him your own name. Okirika don't have name. I can buy this shirt 50 euro, uh, 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 50 euro or 50 dollars, $50, but in Okirika, I can be 1 euro. You can wear it, it will be at the same as mine. It's your own mindset. It's your own mindset. Use your head. Take care of yourself. I love you. Remember, don't give up. It's not over until God says so. I'll meet you next time in my next video. You see, as I told you before, I'm not in the house. I go to somewhere and just chilling out with my husband. So I'm just drinking here my coffee. I say, let me talk to my people out there, my beautiful family out there. I love you, but Jesus love you more. My husband says I should say hi to you all. Bye. Ciao. Enjoy yourself all the time. Sometimes take your glass, go out, buy your coffee, sit down, enjoy yourself, drink it easily when you or make it in your in your house just give it to your husband sweetheart let's sit together enjoy yourself enjoy yourself okay bye bye love you chest chest